Hey guys, welcome back to the channel and in today's video I want to share with you guys what's quickly becoming one of my favorite iOS 13 features. Now, you may or may not know that Siri Shortcuts is now a built-in application in iOS 13. And the Siri Shortcuts application now has a new feature called Create Personal Automations. Now, if you watch my channel here, you already know that I have a little bit of an issue with the lack of ability to customize the lock screen on the iPhone. We don't have the weather, all we have is the date and time, and yes, the notifications. We don't have the ability to customize it like we do on the Apple Watch, which is sort of interesting. Hopefully, the Apple will bring that in the future, but for now, I'm going to show you how to customize these extensions or shortcuts on Face ID devices. We have the flash, which is very convenient, but we also do have the camera on the right, which doesn't make a lot of sense to me. As I mentioned before on previous videos, we can swipe to the right to get to the camera, and it would be really cool if Apple could allow users to customize that camera button to function as any other application or extension that you wish. So that is what I'm going to share with you guys today, how to customize that extension on the lock screen. So the first thing you want to do is you want to head on over to the Siri Shortcuts application. You want to head on over to Automations here, and then you want to create a personal automation. Now, right here, what you want to do is you want to swipe all the way to the bottom of the page, and you want to click on open applications now for this option here you want to go ahead and select the application that you want for that automation to work for so we want to change the actual extension on the lock screen so that's going to be the cameras application so we're going to select camera and click done now what you want to do is you want to click on next and then you want to add the action that you want for this particular application so let's go to applications open app and then we're going to tap on apps and then we're going to select the application that we would like for that particular shortcut to open. So let's say I want Instagram on the lock screen. I click on Instagram, click next, and then you wanna go ahead and turn off ask before running so it's not intrusive and it just launches the application right away. So just click done once you do that. And now when we open the cameras application, it will launch Instagram. So since we have the actual application there on the lock screen, all we have to do is press and hold and it will launch Instagram right away on your iOS device. And this is a very easy way to customize that lock screen extension in iOS 13. This is a really cool new feature built in again to Siri shortcuts that allows you to create automations with an iOS. Now you can change this to whatever it is that you want. It doesn't necessarily have to be the Instagram application. So if I go back into the settings here and I click on open apps, I can remove this one here. Let's go ahead and remove that one and we can add a different application. So let's go ahead and select apps and then we're going to click on open app, click on app. Once again, we're going to change this automation and let's say I want to open the calculator. So now when I click next, click done, when I launch the extension, once again, from the lock screen here, it'll open the calculator. So it's a bit of a workaround, but it is a really cool feature and is quickly becoming one of my favorites because, as I mentioned, one of my biggest complaints on the lock screen is the ability to customize the lock screen. And this brings it one step closer. I hope you guys enjoy this quick tutorial. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys have a great day. I'll see you on the next one. Peace.